Hello and welcome to Turner Time Tutorials. This video is on creating a shortcut to open a new email message in Windows 7. You want to navigate to your desktop. You can do so by holding down the Windows key to the left of your spacebar and the D key for desktop at the same time. Once you're at your desktop, right click, hover your cursor over New, and left click on Shortcut. You're going to type in mail to colon, that's M-A-I-L-T-O colon, and it's very important you type this in exactly as shown or the shortcut will not work. Left click the next button. Now you're going to name the shortcut. Since it's highlighted, you can begin typing. I'm going to call this new message. You can call it new email as well. When you're finished naming it, click on finish. Now on your desktop, you'll see a shortcut for a new message. Now let's create a keyboard shortcut for this. If you have a folder on your desktop called Desktop Shortcuts, which will allow you to keep all the shortcuts you create in one place and not clutter up your desktop, you're going to want to move this shortcut into that folder first. So I'm going to left click on the shortcut, drag it over, and drop it inside my keyboard shortcuts. Once I've dragged it and dropped it into my desktop shortcut folder, I'm going to double click on that folder to open it. Here is the shortcut I just created for new message. I'm going to right click on that shortcut, left click on properties, left click in the shortcut key box to place your cursor there. We're going to use E as our keyboard shortcut. Simply press E on your keyboard. Windows 7 will automatically insert Control plus Alt plus E. Control Alt is a default shortcut. Once you've done this, left click on OK. And now no matter what I'm doing, I can hold down Control Alt and E on my keyboard and a new email message will open ready for me to send. This will be a great time saver. Please see online tutorials for additional videos on how to move a shortcut that you've created onto your quick launch toolbar in Windows 7. If you have any questions, please email info at getturnertime.com. Thanks for watching and have a productive day.